Hello, ladies and gentlemen, crypto deep divers. Welcome back to Weekly Crypto. Today, I'm still broadcasting from Twin Falls, Idaho, and so I want just I just want to do some update about um, the current social unrest uh, across America, and we are suspecting uh, there's some. Maybe the Chinese Communist Party is also involved as well. So the reason why I say that is because there's a video coming out of YouTube, uh, not YouTube, uh, Facebook, um, that there's some Chinese, uh, I think uh, mainland Chinese, they speak Mandarin. Um, they damage, I think they damage the uh, St. John's Church in uh, near the White House. So. I'm not surprised the CCP, Communist, uh, Chinese Communist Party is also involved in all this different unrest across America. And uh, maybe, I don't, I don't want to say it's a conspiracy, but uh, just, like, just like when there's a, a protest in Hong Kong, they did the same thing. They, uh, they, the protest is initially is peaceful. And, um, and uh, most of the, I mean, the thing is, uh, all, all the demonstration, like almost every, almost every weekend for like, uh, for the extradition law, almost for two months, at least, there's no looting, nothing, no no riots. They're so peaceful the demonstration, and in fact, uh, they pick up their trash uh, during the uh, after the demonstration. So they are very uh, very uh, well. I mean, they they take care of their city in Hong Kong. So, but then if things turn a little bit ugly, and there's some. Uh, they, they, they are setting fire uh, on stuff like that and also there's uh, also there's uh, some uh, looting as well this is probably just uh, sabotaged by the uh, CCP the Chinese Communist Party because they want to uh, <coughs> saying that this uh, protest is not is not um, it's not peaceful uh, they demonstrate uh, they are uh, damaged the society that's what they want to portray so that's why they have some uh, People basically from CCP sabotage the peaceful demonstration demonstrator. So I may. So the thing is, just common sense. Will you attack? A, uh, will Will you attack a church during demonstration? No, because if you have religion, if you have religion, if you are Christian or Catholic or Buddha or whatever religion you have, you you won't attack those things. Your target is probably want to go to department store, right? So I'm suspecting uh, because in the Communist Party, Chinese Communists have no religion whatsoever. They don't believe in God. So that's why I'm suspecting that they are probably. Uh, I, I suspecting uh, they are prob probably they are the one who uh, who create a lot of chaos. And I'm not saying that uh, just the CCP. Maybe some other uh, uh, some other. <coughs> Some other organization also take advantage of this right now. Uh, so this is so unfortunate, very unfortunate. Uh, get to this point, and and the thing is, just it's it's kind of. I mean, I'm a little bit skeptical. Why this is across America? Is it um, maybe it's organized by well organized by some other some some type of organization to want to create chaos in the society? Uh, maybe that is what happened. I'm not sure. Uh, I, I'm I'm not sure actually. So if you want to if you want to know what my thinking, and you can I have a video in my in Patreon. So I talk about what I thought about this whole fiasco. I can't talk about that in YouTube because uh, YouTube will ban me because this sounds like a conspiracy. It's not. Uh, it's not like. Uh, you approve or stuff like that, so that's why I can't say anything in YouTube. So uh, that's my take on it. But this is a this is shocking. Oh, what type is this? What type of ant in this one? Is it fire ants or red ants? Ooh, there's a lot of them in here. Did you see them? So I'm suspecting. I'm suspecting. Um, there's a uh, the Communist Party. They want to uh, create tons of chaos in. America, then they can take over Taiwan and um, take over Hong Kong as well. So that is their plan, I think. And uh, this make 
this is very disturbing. They are they are damaged, uh, destroyed the church, uh, St. John Church. I mean, you don't damage church, right? Even you're in riot or anything. I mean, church is, I mean, to me, even, I don't know. So only people who has no religion will damage church, right? I mean, I'm not saying that people who no religion will damage church, but then even though you have no religion, you will not damage church. This thing is only, can only done by the ruthless uh, totalitarian regime, which is the communist party, unfortunately. Um, I, I don't want to say, say anything further, but the thing is, in Facebook, <coughs> in Facebook, uh, there's a video about, there's a whole bunch of Chinese, uh, mainland Chinese speaking Mandarin, uh, uh, saying that, hey, let's go, let's go, something like that. So, um, so the, the, the accent is mainland Chinese, it's not Taiwanese, because I, yeah, I don't know, whatever. Uh, this is just, uh, just uh, because I asked my friend about all this different dialect, I have no idea. So, so I'm suspecting uh, it's from the mainland Chinese, they want to create chaos. And, sub and also there's a lot of uh, mainland Chinese students in studying in the US. So the CCP probably, you know, tell them to uh, damage church, damage some iconic uh, statue or stuff like that. I mean, during the riot, you don't you don't damage those stuff. You probably damage the store, right? Uh, you you uh, damage Macy's or Apple Store, or looting stuff like that, or or Target. You know, Target got got hit really bad too, and Walmart as well. So why you attack a church? I mean, you're not going to get anything from the church. So I'm suspecting this is from the from the Chinese Communist Party um, uh, machine in the U.S. So, the, the, you know, in the U.S., there's a lot of infiltrate by the Chinese Communist Party, a whole bunch of Chinese students. They may, they may be a spy uh, for the Chinese government. You, you never know. And they probably receive a lot of money from them as well. And um, so right now, you've got to be careful. Um, so let me know what you think about all this. Uh, it's very disturbing to see things turn out so ugly. And... This is interesting. The force is over the other side. Is it amazing? So, oops. Ooh. There's some rocks falling off. It just freaked me out. <laughs> anyway. Ooh. Landslide. Oh, scare me. It's just falling off. It's a snake. Anyway, you know, I just I just climbed up from here somewhere. I didn't use this row. I used somewhere. I was almost fell off because I wanted to do a shortcut. I, I just climbed up from somewhere from the wilderness in here. Okay, from the uh, from the small little slope in here. So hopefully I I was almost almost lose control. But anyway, but it was fun anyway. Uh, <clears throat> So there's a huge golf course in here. This is a Centennial uh, Park or something in uh, Twin Falls in U uh, Idaho. So if you if you stop by Twin Falls, make sure you stop by this uh, beautiful. Uh, uh, this is a Snake Canyon River over there. There's a bridge. The the fall is a Perrine a bridge. Uh, the Perrine Fall and Perrine. If I didn't pronounce it right, Perrine uh, Bridge and Perrine Falls. And then there's a. Uh, you, you can see a whole bunch of uh, river in the middle. You can basically kayaking to different uh, areas. And you can see there's also another fall as well. Uh, I forgot the name. It looks really beautiful. But depending on the tide, if the tide is high tide, you, you don't see those uh, interesting rocks. So I yesterday I was coming from the other side. Today I'm, I'm hiking, not really hiking. I'm climbing from here. I'm scratched, almost fell, almost fell off, fell, fell off from the slope anyway. But I'm I'm fine. Uh, but I'm just all my clothing is covered with dirt right now, so it's pretty interesting. <clears throat> so I'm going back down right now. Uh, let me know what you think about all this social unrest. Are you prepared for this? Uh, is this a grand finale of everything? Uh, what? Let me know what you think. I would love to hear from you. Um, so I'm going downhill, going to a regular, regular, regular road, a regular trail. Uh, I, I don't want to fall off. I mean, I can just uh, roll myself down over there, right? <laughs> because when I climb up, I say, okay, I can climb up, climb up from all this 
crazy slope. Okay, there's no trail actually. Anyway, and uh, I, and luckily I didn't see any snakes or, or whatsoever. But I'm going to walk uh, back down using a trail. I don't want to uh, get injury. Uh, so let me know what you think about all this fiasco right now, uh, coronavirus and. Um, Actually, I need to go back uh, when I go get back. I'm going to look at the study and everything and see if we are going to have a second wave. Uh, I need to look at it. Maybe we, if we have enough herd immunity, we may not have a second wave. So we'll see. I need to go back and check uh, the study and uh, what's going on out there and everything. Uh, hopefully, we don't have a second wave. Uh, but the thing is, looks like the first wave haven't finished yet. So the second wave we're talking about probably uh, around... Um, in the uh, winter, uh, September, October, uh, those time. So I need to go back and look. And let me know what you think. Uh, in my Patreon group, I post a video about what um, what was my thought about coronavirus and also the riots, the looting, the social unrest um, in the uh, in across America. Um, so let me know what you think uh, about this video. Do you think the scenery is beautiful? If if it is beautiful, smash the like button, subscribe to my channel. Also share with your friends. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out the upcoming videos. Also, you can follow me on Twitter, library.tv and Patreon as well. So thank you for all the comments. I Because my selfie stick is broken, right now I try to be as steady as possible. When you're holding your hand with your cell, uh, when you're holding... Uh, your hand with your cell phone and the mic and everything is kind of difficult to maneuver. Uh, but thank you for your for your comment. I will, um, I will try to be more steady with my camera and all that. Okay, okay. Uh, make sure you comment below. That will help my ranking as well. And remember, crypto deep divers. We the people take control of our money. Stay wise, stay safe, peace. I'm not your financial advisor. Investing in cryptocurrency, commodities, stock market can has inherent risks. Use your due diligence. And peace out.